Hi there, AV enthusiasts. Are you tired of complicated, expensive AV over IP systems? Well, we have a solution for you. Introducing the IP280. It's a powerful and affordable AV over IP solution. So let's get into why the IP280 is a great solution for you. So the IP280 is an AV over IP system that transmits 4K60 up to 400 feet over Cat5e6 cable. Using IP string technology, the IP280 has ultra high definition visuals as well as ultra low latency signal. And then also it's ideal for home theaters, classrooms, as well as conference rooms. It supports one-to-one, -one, one to many and many-to-many -many connections with the gigabit switch. It also has an HDMI loopout, bi-directional IR, as well as RS-232 control. The IP280 is the ultimate solution for all of your AV needs. So let's get into it. Okay, so now we're gonna go over the connections of the IP280 4K60. So first we have two transmitters and three receivers. And we have the one receiver going to this monitor, another receiver going to this TV behind me, and a third receiver going to our touch board screen right over here to my right. And so each transmitter has their own source. We have a Chromecast and a Roku streaming device. We also have the laptop connected to the switch through this ethernet connection. And all devices are also connected to the switch over ethernet connection. Okay, so now that we have everything connected, we're gonna go over to our PC here and start configuring our system on the web interface or the web GUI of the switch. Before we log in, we actually want to set our computer's IP to match the IP scheme of the switch. We're gonna go to network and internet, advanced network settings, go down to ethernet two or whichever the ethernet connected port you're in, more adapter options, hit edit. Internet protocol version four, use the following IP address. So we're gonna set it to 192.168.15.190, tab. Forty, hit okay, hit okay. 192.168.15.103. So this is the IP address we've set the switch to. And the reason why this is important is because the IP of the computer must match the IP scheme of the switch that you're connected to in order to log in to the default. So right now we've already changed the IP of the switch to match our network's IP scheme. So that was 192.168.15.103. So we hit uh, select it. So let's say we wanted to change that or set it. 192.168.15.103. And then we wanna make sure the net mask is matching as well, 255.240. Dot zero. Once that's done, you would hit apply. Once applied, log back in. Hit save. We want to go to our network settings and set, make sure our laptop or computer is set to obtain automatically, which it is. Hit OK. We also want to make sure that the switch is connected to the network through a landline, um, either directly to the router or through a patch network port. So right now, everything is set on the network. We have our switch, which is also on the network. And now we can move on to adding the switch to our app. Okay, guys, so now that we have the web set up, we have everything on the network. Now we can move on to the app and getting our switch connected to the app and I will show you how to do the switching there. First, what we wanna do is go to the Zenti app. Wanna hit this plus sign here, 
switch. Right now we're using the ZT383 or the IPS24 V3. Display name can just be switch or whatever you'd like it to be. Now we enter the IP address 192.168.15.102.11. Username is admin, password is admin, hit done. All right, now we get this green link light here indicating we are linked. Now we can do some switching. So right now we got port 13 is seeing source two. Let's switch it to source one and we can change the LG TV to source number two. We could change the monitor to source number one. You also can create some presets down below, up to eight different presets. And then we have different windows where we can see our inputs, our outputs, also where you can also select which port is going to get the source. Status, you can see on the status page which ports are connected which inputs are going to what output, and your assigned output and input ports. Well, there you have it. The IP280 is the affordable, efficient, feature-packed AV over IP system that you've been waiting for. Ready to upgrade your setup? Well, like this video if you enjoyed this content, if it was helpful for you. Go ahead and subscribe to our channel for more content like this, and we'll see you in the next video.